Hey you guys, hey you guys, it's your girl Kayla B. You know when I'm coming at you with another video, it's another video. And today is a First Impressions Friday. You already know, you already know. And we're just gonna go right here, right here, right here, right here. Like, Kayla, why are you doing this right now? Or are you just going straight in the video? It's because, um, well, um, I'm just going straight in the video. I'm just going straight into the video. By the way, I have a TikTok account, I have an Instagram, I have a Snapchat, everything will be linked down below in the description, go check it out. And the first product that I'm going to be using, that I'm going to be testing out, is a brow product. Two brow products actually. One is the NYX Micro Brow Pencil and in the shade Espresso, and the other one is the Milk Makeup Hydro Brow Gel. Now, I'm going to test two things out, two theories out, and I'm doing it real fast before my concealer dries, because you don't want a concealer to dry out on you. You can always put more concealer on. Um, that's what I would do. That is what I would do. Oh my gosh. There's tape on both ends. I just end up ripped. I just end up ripping it. I just end up ripping it. Okay, you got a spoolie on one end, and you got the pencil on the other end, and it's a fine pencil. Um, let's see. Oh, yep, that shade would work right there. Right there. That shade would work. So let's just get it up in there. I like to do a line first to go to basically arch out my brows. I do this with everybody. I just like to do a line to, you know, that's where it starts, you know? Then I do the top. And now here is where I use the gel in two different ways. I'm going to go in with the gel first and then I'm going to fill it in. I'm going to let it wait and then I'm going to fill it in. And then the other side, I'm just going to go in with it afterwards and then go in with the spoolie. That's the two ways that I use gel and I want to see if it will change the outcome with this type of gel. So I'm going to wait on this side before I fill the rest of my brow in and then I'm gonna just fill in this side and I like how it goes from chocolatey to dark darker like if you could actually see it's dark but then the tip is darker like that means that it it has pink Oh, and it's not taking any of my hairs off. It's just perfect. I, I'm starting to like this. I'm starting to like this pencil. Now that that dried down on that side, I'm just gonna fill everything in, the little brow hairs, everything. Just fill it in. It's going over the gel really nicely, and the hairs that stick down, like stuck down, is not going anywhere. Hmm. And that's cool. Okay, now I'm going in with the gel on the other side just to go out. I can see that I took some of the um the color off, which I don't like. I don't like that at all. Alright, going back in with the concealer and Touching up the brows. Going back over where I put it in. Just double it up before I blend it out. And you're like, Kayla, why did you put that in there if you was just gonna put more on it? Fuller coverage, fuller freaking coverage. Do you not see that? Do you not see that? Do you not see that? Okay, the next and the last thing that I'm going to be talking about is NARS. This is Deep One Jurency. 
This is the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer. Has SPF 30. It's got like a little sample. I was really mad when I did my other order. And I couldn't get another sample. So this is what it looks like. It kind of looks like a concealer shade. This is the shade that it said that I was. So hopefully it's not a concealer shade. And my actual shade. Let's see if it's deeper than what is in the tube looking like. I mean, it's matte packaging. So, oh no, it's not. It's light. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so. It's blending into my skin. It's blending into my skin though. My skin kind of looks like it has a white cast. It definitely looks like it has a white cast. You know, it's blending. It's blending. I definitely need it around my forehead line. Overall, my first impression thoughts on the brow product is that the gel definitely used before because it takes off it doesn't add to the um the brow it doesn't add to the brow besides keeping it stiff in the place and it keeps it stiff in the place so after you do those two lines and before you fill it in definitely put the brow gel in or put the brow gel in before you do the lines just so your brows don't go nowhere but if you want something that's going to add or like smooth out that fill that is not the brow gel for that not at all the brow pencil it was really nice it wasn't too creamy it wasn't too hard it was just right i really liked it i mean it was more on the stiff side than the creamy side um if i really want to be specific but it was actually really good it was really good and the bristles the spoolie it wasn't too hard but it was hard enough to like get my brows and I'm, I'm not mad at it i'm not mad at it the brow gel though i had better i mean i had benefit 24 hour and that did not move the product like that okay it did not do that it did not do that i really hate this packaging from fenty because it gets so messy so messy real quick oh this is the blush i've been wearing a lot a lot this month a lot okay now the the tinted moisturizer is a little light but it's not like the maybelline one which is like was really dark um, I mean, I made that work and I made this work. It's just that um, the concealer and the foundation just, it went well together. It went really well together. Like, the, the concealer and the foundation is basically the same color. It's the same color. color all right now i'm gonna go in with some cookie blush for powder i went in with um pat mcgrath um blur powder so yeah so those are my first impression thoughts it's just i go like this it's just I just I don't know I don't know I don't know about how I feel about this tinted moisturizer that they said that that was my shade and it's like really light but I'm making it work so I'm not mad but also I wear concealer usually when I wear tinted moisturizer I just wear that so the next time you see me and it's gonna be a review I'm just going to wear that and that only um but yeah that's it for this video i hope you like this like 12 minute long video of me just rambling about first impressions of products that i haven't tried until now and have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and deuces 
And if you see my Epsi video before this, it's because, and I look the same, it's because I filmed it in the same day. And if you haven't, it will be linked above in the cards. Go check it out. Video right here, video right here, head right here. So yeah, those are my thoughts. Deuces.